Once upon a time there was a little girl called Sophie and and she lived in the dormitory. And and an orphanage. And whenever she got out of bed, she got they all got punishment because they got out of bed. I didn't fall over. And so they got out of bed one night. And she got out of bed. And she, well, she heard the myth shouting, Who's that got out of the bed? And so they cried. Now get into bed. Okay. And she, she crept and opened her window and looked out of the window and she saw this big black thing. She thought it was the witch night. Well, witch. Oh, snitching. Little girls and boys. And she, she went into the window and peeped again. And she, she looked out of the window again, quiet. And She saw that this witch was opening the suitcase and taking a bottle out with a green thing in. And she didn't know what the green thing was. And the sort of witch and twisted his hand and there came a big trumpet. He put, poured the bottle of green stuff into the trumpet but nothing came out. And he opened the boy and girl's window and blow through the jump. But no sound came out. And so they saw the, the man coming nearer and nearer. And she hid under a blanket. She peeped out and there was an enormous hand coming into her bedroom window. He snitched her. And she far she looked at the giant. And she thought, Um, they, they ran so fast, so they beat her head out, and then she saw that they were flying, and then she saw this world, and it was beautiful on the world, because there was a big Cave, and the giant went in it, and in that cave there was 
Loads of shelves. And the giant put the put Sophie down. And Sophie be, came out and put her you know blanket over herself so she wouldn't get cold. And she said, you're not going to be in. And the B and the giant name was BFG. My name is BFG. That stands for the Big Friendly Giant. Was what's that? And the BFG opened the cupboard, and inside the cupboard was this big, enormous snot cumber. Okay. 
tasting screwy or screwy, stonky, screwy, scrumptious. Oh, oh yes, scrumptious. My voice doesn't sound like yours. And this big cup in his hand, and he poured some frog scuckle into the cup, and he drunk them. And he says, "It tastes yummy." Do you? Oh, I forgot something. Well. Well, he said it tastes heavy. What? I mean, he just said was. And he went flying in the air. Because he was just going to say, Was you wanting that ride? But he said it when he came back to him again. Was you wanting that ride? Yes, yes, yes. She got. He got this little cup, poured some and he gave it to Sophie. She drank it out. Mm. And there was a fly in his a uh, kind of a rat. And there was a little break of hopes. He got it, <laughs> licked it all. Sophie went flying in the air. The rat went flying in the air. But the rat was even funnier than anyone else. He did this. <laughs> she did. Because I saw it. Well, and next, it was the Song Buck Beatty song Frost Buckle Whiz Papa Made nice voice But he said something this one He said Frog Scuckle Frog Scuckle Instead of Frog Scuckle And he got his voice in the arm giant and she said to Sophie well now we are in giant country shall we go outside yes answered Sophie and they went out she said what the things up to horrible they are the giants what scrunch Oh. Human beings. <laughs> Turkey people are to sing like Turkish giraffe. And with it, he's taking that. Ice cream. And um. well, I know Scotland is taking my vinegar. Sophie didn't like vinegar. She pulled her tongue out. And she was feeling a bit sickly. Because same vinegar. And they went back in again. And the 
enormous big giant blood bubble. Who are you talking to, BFG? I smell human beings. No, 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 no. There's no human beings here. And the blue buckle grabbed the BFG and said, You are going to help me find the young being. But the fly that tasted a bit of this nut come back made a big hole and it was looking green. Because inside it was big slime and it was green. And so they crept into it. Really big hole. And he. Oh, but this is a frightening bit. And the BFG said, Do you want a taste of. Snow's cucumber? Why, what does it taste like? said the blood buckler. It tastes like sludgy slime, fruit, fruity peaches, and bones and blood. But so he was in the Snow scumber and the BFG handed it through the blood buckler. The blood buckler did this. And Sophia looked out and she saw that she was in the blood buckler's mouth and all this green slimy. Thick was coming out of his mouth. And I said, <coughs> He's spitting it out. I said, <coughs> You tell lies. It didn't taste like peachy fruits, slime, blood, and bones. And the BFG was half crying because he didn't know where Sophie was. He thought that she was in the blue buckles to me. Of course, the blue buckles only had this big rag on him. When he was crying. and all this green water came out and into a little bathtub and she went she took her all her clothes and went into the small warm bathtub and she said it's gorgeous Oh, 
Chips. Well, the BFG drew this big pop set with all this needles in and material. You got this yellow one This big roll of green cotton. And he got the cotton onto the needle. And he did a special dress for our soul And she grasped, she said, that's especially for me. Yes, try it on and see if it fits. So if we tried it on, it fit perfectly. And she yawned. Water that I can drink. Water? There's no water here. As I said, there was only frogs got on this copper. As now, and now we are going to catch some streams. As you saw, I got these buckles out of my case. That's my best niche tube. And now, we are going to catch some dreams. But how to catch some dreams? Aha! Uh -huh. He lived in his big long ears. Do you not see my big floppy ears? But how do you catch them with your ears? I don't catch them with my ears. I, I can hear every little whisper in the world. I can hear flowers talking to each other. Frogs. By knowing what frog the language is with, with it is for I like you. Don't tell me this. Okay. Please just go to the green land. I've never seen it. I've never let anyone see the green land. Ever. started throwing big stones at him. And they got him said, What are you doing? I'm going to dreamland to catch dreams again. Oh dear. Yes, you want the I smell human beings. No? Yeah. And they played with him. They throwed him up. And then never catched him. Just one problem before. And then he just ran away. Quickly. Stress was on. And then he missed it off the cave. And it's beautiful. 
bakmamış. Ben teşekkür ediyoruz. She was fainting off. And, and, and because it was a giant. And said, and said, Do you want your breakfast? Yes. You have no snot cumbers, have you? Snot cumbers? Well, well, 
everywhere. I know that bed makes me dizzy. So can I have some here to take home? Thank you. And yes, he got something. It was a gold head with a, a big red hair top saying to the Majesty. I'm giving it to the Queen and saying thank you. And then they went. And the blue box was lying on the floor because these men were attacking him. And I wish they would kill him because they couldn't kill him because he was giant. But they came in this big helicopter. No. It's the end.